Really simple syndication is a popular and very practical means of subscribing to particular websites. To show you what I mean, let's compare two ways of surfing the net. This is what most people do. When they want to check their favourite websites, they type the address in their browser or go to their bookmarks. They click and wait to see if the website has been updated. This is inefficient and is like going across a city to pick up a single magazine when you're actually interested in reading several. You have to go to the effort for each page and if you've left it for too long, you might miss important updates. If you're lucky, you'll find that update and get to read it. But what usually happens is you come all this way and you see nothing new. If you keep doing this, it's a lot of time wasting and frustration. This is how RSS comes in useful. Do you recognize this symbol? It comes in many shapes and forms and you will have seen it on a lot of pages online, perhaps without paying much attention to it. When you add RSS feeds to what's called a feed reader, you can access all the new articles from all your favorite sites in just one place. There are lots of good readers available and you probably already have one in your browser or email program. So let me give you an example of how it can be useful. Let's imagine that every day I check these websites. Facebook to see some friend status updates, an interesting blog, a news site, and particular searches on an accommodation website and on Google. I could go to each one and maybe see something that wasn't there before. Or there might be nothing. Or even worse, I could get sidetracked and waste time. But each one of these websites has an RSS feed for what I want. So I take these and put them in my favourite reader, which is Google Reader. Then that's just one place to go to when I want to see all my updates. Less time is wasted and since all changes are tracked and stored as long as you want, you'll never miss anything. There are so many websites you can do this for, and it's a much more useful way of using the internet. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to my website's RSS feed. You can find more information and useful links in this video's description. Thanks for watching.